Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how to create a ripples effect using the Unity particle system. So let's get started. Start by creating a new particle system and rename it to ripples underscore ps. Now inside renderer, Set the max particle size to 3 and let's zoom out a little bit. Okay, now reset the transform. Set the start lifetime to random between two constants and the values will be 0 0.5 and 1. After that, set the speed to 0. Now set the start size to 1 and the start color will be white with a little bit transparency set the alpha value to 50 after that we have to uncheck shape now we will create a texture inside photoshop for the ripple, ripple effect uh, start by creating a new file set its size to 512 by 512 okay now paint it to using the paint bucket tool set its color to black now create a new layer change the color back to white now select the ellipse tool here set the fill to none and stroke to white click on the center of the screen and press alt and shift to make a proportional circle um, I think the width of the circle is a bit too thin. We can increase the width, something like this. Bring it to the center of the screen. Now double click here and it will open the blending options. Click on auto glow and here adjust the values. Something like this. Now as it has the blurred effect, Click on OK, hide the background, save this image as a PNG and rename it to Ripple. I am saving it to my downloads folder. Let's rename it to Ripple's VFX or Ripple Texture. Click on OK. Our effect is saved. Now drag and drop into your assets folder. Click on Alpha is transparent and hit apply. Now create a new material and rename it to ripples underscore matte. Now set the shader to legacy shader, particles, additive drag and drop your ripple texture now drop this ripple texture onto the ripple particle system zoom in a little bit and this is what you can see right now next what we are going to do is inside the emission set the rate over time to zero check burst and set the value of burst to three now here inside color over lifetime set the value something like this start will be zero one and then zero after that set size over lifetime and it will be this graph then we will uncheck looping and uh, inside the renderer I will select horizontal billboard. So this is how we create ripples in Unity using the Unity particle system. You can create multiple versions of it. Let's change the lifetime to 0 0.5. 
two. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Make sure to like and subscribe. We will see you in a new video. Goodbye.